Hi! Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're just new here. Um, so tonight, I just want to answer this question. It uh, There was a question for me. It says, why am I getting this error code COV-026? And I saw online that um, CRA said that if you had tried applying for CRB and got this error saying you're ineligible, please try again. If your application continues to be stopped, it's because you might be eligible for EI or you applied for EI earlier this year. So please do that. Please try again. And if, if you don't get any results and if it's still an error, then maybe you are eligible for EI. And the one way to check if you also applied for EI before is to call Services Canada. I know somebody, a subscriber commented that he, when he was getting so many errors, he called Services Canada and he found out later on that actually he did apply for EI in Services Canada. Although he didn't submit any reports, he didn't do anything with that application. He applied in CRA later for CRB and kept applying in the CRA website. But he forgot that he did apply in uh, Services Canada uh, over the phone. So that was the mix-up. So maybe that's your case as well. Also, um, another subscriber asked me, why is he getting uh, only one why is he asked to do only one week report for the period of october 18 to the 24th so he applied for ei on september 27 he was asked to report from october 4 to the 17th so that's two weeks and then after that he was only asked for a report for October 18 to 24. It's because uh, when he initially applied in the Services Canada for the EI, um, on, the sept on September 27, he was made to report from September 27 to October 3 because that was Services Canada thinking it was for the CERB application. So when he did his next reporting from October 4 to October 17, um, that is already it's two weeks yes but it's a, a mixture of the first week and the second bi-weekly report supposed to be so when they so just to complete the two weeks uh, they made him report for the remaining one week which is October 18 to the 24th so that's my guess because um, I, sh I will be reporting very soon for my EI report and my report should be September 27 to October 10 so when he started his application he cut through one week so um, I guess there's that's the confusion so after this October 8 October for October 18 to 24 hopefully he will go back to normal normal bi-weekly report so I just want to clear that out and so in case you are on the same situation um, you will already know so I guess I will only address those questions for tonight. I just want to put this out and then uh, I hope you are well and safe wherever you are right now. And by the way, thank you so much for watching my videos and thank you for subscribing and thank you for liking my videos and leaving nice comments. Have a good night and be safe.